I think I'm recording this. Uh, so you go to autodesk.com slash ed education. We're going to um, look up. We're going to sign in with your Autodesk ID. going to get products. AutoCAD version 2022. Oh boy. So you'll get a message, something reinforcing like that. Uh, that you have. So AutoCAD change to version uh, 2022. Select download instead of install so that we download the installation software and then Okay, I've already done this once But just to demonstrate I'm going to save it Shouldn't take an hour. It's that's what it says, but it should not take that long Once you've done that, you can show in folder. Okay, that's the one that's downloading now. I'm going to cancel that because I have AutoCAD 22 install program right here. So once you've done that, you can double click that. I'm not sure that's showing up in your screen, is it? I'm going to switch the window so it shows. Okay, that should be sharing that now. And I'm going to extract to the default folder. You accept the default. doesn't take very long uh, to install AutoCAD. So far it's been five minutes.
considerably uh, smaller foot, footprint than Revit architecture, right? 3.4, 3.74 gigabytes compared to 11 and some. Let me make sure that that is showing on your screen. Got all that? Agreed to terms of use. Choose where to ins install. Again, simply accept the default additional components reporting tool I don't think you need to bother with that so far it's been six and a half minutes Okay, that's not bad. We're not even up to 10 minutes. I can start using AutoCAD by clicking that. Usually what you want to do when you finish installing a program is to restart your computer. But let's see what happens. I'm going to share that screen now. window is eluding me. I should have it shortly.
There we go. Okay. That's AutoCAD. There's a version of AutoCAD that has architectural elements called Auto, AutoCAD Architecture. Uh, that isn't the one you want to install. Although I don't see any harm in doing that. In, in the past, we've used that uh, professionally because it has some prepackaged um, elements that are used in architecture, like stairs and doors and walls. Okay. So that is. All that's involved in installing AutoCAD from Autodesk. <laughs>